Hey, it was Davo. What's going on, everybody? We got new Percival and a new Wild and and, and a new banner out. Also, Wild is free, so he's not on the banner. So go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe to the notification, all that good stuff. Let's get into the information. First and foremost, uh, I don't want to blow out your ears. I ain't that loud. This is loud for me. So let's take a look at this ultimate animation. Doria! Looks to be single target. Okay. Just slaps the mess out of you. Okay, 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 okay. I'm involved with it. I'm involved with it. Oh, let me go ahead and mute, mute that in case we want to replay. So, Percival information. Let's go ahead and take a look. See, let's pull up uh, both, uh, well, all three images and whatnot. I'm pretty sure there's something else in the patch notes. But uh, the adventure begins, Percival, the boy of hope. At the start of, all right, a new, a new beginning. At the start of battle, grants, grants you the will of patience for two turns. Increasing the defense related abilities of each specific ally participating in battle by 10%. Pretty good. Also, when you use a single single target skill, you will inflict a concentrated attack on the target for two turns. And for each surviving ally, your HP related abilities will increase by 10%. And each ally who is incapacitated will receive a 10% concentrated attack, increases your critical damage by 100%. When he says yours, does he mean everybody or just them? That's what. My question. Will of Endurance is that receive 30% of, da of damage taken by allies other than yourself and immediately recover 50% of damage. Will of Endurance is that? Yeah, the Will of Patience. The Will of Endurance is what that is. Receive 30% damage reduction. And then immediately recover. Bro, that's Tarmel Link for what? Is he, am I crazy? Is he, is he good? In a way. And then specific allies are humans, seven deadly sins, or seven deadly sins. Okay, cool. In a way. He he might have good CC too. Of course he'd be green because look at this hair. Um and then concentrated attack, critical resistance minus thirty percent. If you receive damage from a single single target skill twice in an enemy's turn, receive plus fifty percent damage. Increase in damage received only occurs once per turn. What? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Da Quick resistance. If you receive damage from a single attack skill twice in an enemy's turn, receive plus 50% damage dealt. Increase in damage received only occurs once per turn. Why would I take more damage? I think it's for the enemy. So if I get two, what? This, I'm, this is not making sense to me in my head. Uh, first skill, lively combo. Deals assault damage equal to 450% of attack to a single enemy. Assault is critical rate increased times two. And when attacking an enemy on a concentrated, concentrated attack, damage dealt plus 100%. Am I tweaking or is that good? Immature slash deal damage equal to 450% of attack to a single enemy and reduces special move gauge by three. So he has a drain. That's pretty good. And then Slap of Anger. Oh, I love this ultimate name. Uh, give yourself a 50% increase in attack-related abilities for two turns. A 50% increase in damage taken to an enemy. No, 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 no. A 50% increase in damage taken to a single enemy and inflicts cutting damage equal to seven. Oh, my God. That's a strong single target. That's... Oh my god, new Belmos unit. I just, <laughs> I just realized these are physical attacks and not ranged attacks. New Belmos unit, ain't no way. I need this received 30% damage taken by allies other than yourself. This is crazy with Escanor. And immediately 50%, no, immediately recover 50% of damage. This is Bonkers. He is a must summon for Escanor. If you like love Escanor, bro, he. And now Fumi buff. <laughs> Escanor. He's a must summon. He's a must summon for human team. He replaced Arthur. Ain't no way. If not, if if he didn't replace Arthur front line, then obviously you can run him back line because these symbols mean you can run him front line. I mean, I mean back line. I mean. So his his skills, I'm not too I mean, drain useful with this. I need to see his stats. Other than that, I think this guy looks pretty good. 
He looks pretty neat. I think I might go for the 6-6. Six, six. You heard it first. So if anybody else uh, says they're going to do the 6-6 six, six after I do it, y'all, they're copying Dave. So uh, let's move on to Wild. Um, I said uh, I want to open the image. In the so when uh, Big Brother appears, when you participate in battle with a specific ally, all stats of yourself and specific ally will increase by 50%. Specific allies is Captain Hawk and also in Hawk. Dead, 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 dead. All right. Yeah, I know he's he's probably free, but dead, bro. Like legitimately dead. Uh, it does pierce damage, and then that's drain. Cool. I mean, maybe if we had a good hawk, but all the also on hawks and hawks are just like absolutely fodder. Like, well, I guess the red one might. Well, the green one gets defense. I mean, uh, that's 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 probably all. It's, it's still it's unrunnable. He he's just unrunnable. And then his ultimate deals uh sever uh increased crit rate times three. Eh, Purgatory Warrior Wild. I mean, free box CC. We we move. So let's take a look at the banner. Fantastic. I'm gonna go six six because I need you and you. I need one more of you and everybody else to finish. So I don't know about Camilla. I think Camilla's done. I don't know about her either. But we 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 got to see. Uh, ZDB saying it's mid. Oh my God! I'm finna just uh, 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 give me give me something. Give me a mean. Give me something mean to say. Give me something mean to say. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. F U ZDB. I'm gonna say shh. If y'all don't know that clip of Dave Chappelle, it's just I'm saying like just F him, bro. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's this this banner is huge. Uh, not for any. For, for y'all, I'm, I'm speaking from y'all, from Davo's perspective. For me, I like the banner. Uh, for like general population of players, horrible. All right, she's bad. Uh, goddesses are dead. Of our list is pretty good in PVE. Camilla's useless. Uh, he used to be decent. Uh, Cusack is a pretty good demon backline, but people don't run demon backlines. They actually just run CC buffers. So dead, uh, dead on the banner. Shen is awful, but I am one of the Fox CC. He's a pretty good farming unit. Don't sleep on him. I use him for go. I use him. Awake Green Awake Kamano and Brunhild. Bro, put all those debuffs on him, bro. Every everybody died. Every turn. You, you don't gotta worry about nothing. And then Tarmio, go to link. I don't know why Tarmio's here, but we move. Um Yeah, let me let me go ahead and open up the, the rest of the patch notes and see what else are we missing. All right, two new characters. Uh, okay, you can play with Percival. His outfits. Hey, yo. This is crazy. Bro looks like a Splatoon character. Am I tweaking? I might be tweaking. Uh, Guild Balls, Packs, 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 Devil Territory. Oh, these packs are awful. When they offer like this with no gems, it's, it's like, what's the point, bro? Power up tickets, that's a scam, don't buy it. That's coming from uh, an experienced uh, well who has done the research. Uh, Green tickets, finally. Uh, We get to... You, well, we get a free multi on Percival, so you could get him. Wait, is he just a regular 600 banner? Oh, yeah, he is. Of course, he's not a physical. Oh, duh. Uh, then Wild, the green, where you get a free Thonar, and oh, another dude for Arthur. Cool. Uh, this Ragnarok Merlin is not completely horrible, but I mean, she is pretty poop compared to most uh, units. Uh, then we got the new, new passive effects thing. So, ooh, I mean, I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Card flip event. All this green. Holy green, man. Oh my goodness. A must summon for, for Eskimer? I, th I, I think this is a must summon. Is this a final boss? Oh, for all oh, the brothers. Right. Okay. I mean, I, if I recall, this final boss wasn't like too. If anything, they going to have a mission saying don't use Eskimer. I think that's what it was last time. It was like don't use like light Eskimer or something like that. But Eskimer finna tear them apart, literally. If, with this new Percival too. Oh, Moose Man, let's go. <laughs> And you see you in a in, in a while, boy. Where you been? What is that chaos battle? Uh, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. I'll probably. You know what? I'm gonna try to get 100 gems. That's what I'm gonna try to do. I won't be spamming y'all with videos. I'm gonna still probably be doing showcases. Guess what? Now that we got another human and a sentence buffer, technically, we finna redo all these showcases. Y'all thought I was uh done with doing that kind of showcases? Nah, we finna. We finna spin it back. We finna do oh so many showcases, y'all. And I will be six six and Percival. Not probably not on initially when it comes out, but then like certainly by by the end of the week, I will one hundred percent be doing that. What is it? Item shots for special sales. 
Oh, these LR coins were worth it. I see everything else is probably iffy. Oh, that definitely a multi for 35 pendants. I won't be getting most of this, but like the LR coins, I might definitely try to uh, definitely pick that up. Uh, but yeah, all the outfits returning for these old characters for Light Liz, uh, Mael, Transcendent Bond, Hell, Demon King, and Light Escanor of all people. Wait, yeah, it's Light Escanor. Yeah, it is. I'm tweaking. Uh, that ain't new, Devo. And then New Year's units coming back. Huzzah. Do I have all these outfits? I think I do. I believe I do. It's not GP. Battle event? Oh my god. We, we, we love that. Improvement of Force Ogres. The attribute specific strengthening dungeon for Force Ogres has been combined. And the layout of the dungeon icons has been changed. Going from two to. So gold at the top. And then the events at the bottom. Okay. We move. W. Uh, added chapter skip function. Oh. Oh, is that what that that currency was up there? Way up there. I swear I saw it and I was like, what is this? It might have been in the. No. Was it in the, the jumping box event? It might have been. Now I'm thinking about it. Oh well. Uh, but skipping chapters that that might be pretty big. Now I think about it. People, especially if they. Oh my God! If you just start the game and you get this, they swear. They swear you were just like, oh my God. That's pretty good. Okay. Uh, improved of advertising reward function. Yep. 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 Okay. Okay, I'm good. Oh, wait, wait, what? It's not properly applied. The Falolio Queen Victoria. Okay. Right, right, that's it. Uh, Heroes Arena special character added to season seven. Uh, it's going to be Percival and Escanor. I have yet to even do an Escanor like video in Heroes Arena, but Percival seems to look pretty good. Uh, if you love Escanor, I would say. Devo, you asking Devo, should I summon for Percival? And I got Escanor already. If you have the mean, I would say definitely. And, and plus, he might be like a, a more rare character. I'm actually surprised they didn't put Geld on this banner because, I mean, them two are pretty good. It's fine if, if Gelda ain't on here. If anything, Gelda will be on the, what's it called? The August Festival or something like that? Definitely. Uh, Before September, you will see Gelda again. But that's going to do it. Follow the Sacred Treasure podcast because, you know, if you want to up to date with like news and we actually do go live for our podcast episodes um percival seems to look pretty fantastic i ain't gonna lie to you he looks like uh tristan last year for no 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 he doesn't look like he's like eight times better. Like, he's like 10 times better than uh tristan last year for goddesses last year he was giving like goddesses like what 45 percent defense related sets this this is a bible this, this is this is a whole book out of the bible literally i kid you not and it looks to be pretty good. He can be good on the field. He might be able to be good on the field depending on his stats. But definitely he's going to be useful as a backline. Because, you know, this is this this gets me. Humans got a new backline, baby. So that's going to do it. Peace out. Y'all stay good. Uh, Stay tuned. I'll probably do uh, one showcase uh, today with Escanor. And then I'll probably do two. What am I saying? Of course, y'all know Davo got y'all.